welcome to my vlog. Hello everyone, my name is Cassie A. Bonsa. I'm grade one and I am from the Learning Place International. Today, we are going to do a creative video for science. This is about our science lesson too. The title is Movements of Our Body. So let's review together. Are you ready? Let's go! First, let's always remember that we do movements with our body parts. Now, let's identify the body parts that we use for movement. Number one, hands. Number two, fingers. Number three, neck. Number four, legs. Number five, feet. By using our body parts, we can do a lot of movements and actions. Like the following, first dancing. Second is eating. Third is jumping. Four is painting and drawing. Five is cutting paper. And a lot, lot more movements and actions. Remember, we will learn two types of movements. A commuter movement and non-locomotor movements. Let's review their meaning. First, the locomotor movements, the movement that causes us to move one place to another. Example of locomotor movements are running, second, walking, and the third, swimming. Now let's move to non-locomotor movements. After that, we deal without going one place to another. Non-locomotor examples are eating, drawing, painting, reading, and studying. So now let's have a game to see if you remember locomotor and non-locomotor. Are you ready? Let's do it! The first one is running. Is it locomotor or non-locomotor? Three, three, two, two, one, one, one. And the answer is locomotor movement. Let's go to number two. Eating. Is it locomotor or non-locomotor? Three, two, one. And the answer is non locomotor Good job! The last one is walking. Is it locomotor or non locomotor? Three, two, one. And the answer is locomotor. Good job! Now, let's remember that we use our bodies to do movements and actions. Bye! 